Welcome back to Four Geeks, Five Geeks, where geeks come to ge feel better about their lives by comparison. If I had friends, they'd call me PK. And I am Bozer. And today we're bringing back your favorite news segment, Don't Breaking News. We will be reading updates surrounding the world of geek culture that we have never read before this very moment and we'll have to attempt to keep a straight face the whole time. So without further ado, let's get into today's updates. Bleach is making its return after a nine year hiatus. Luckily, Bleach fans are used to the main character not existing for years at a time only to come back insanely strong and finish off in a week away. In a weak way. In movie ga news, hitting the theaters this Friday is Bird, uh, Birds of Prey and the fantabulous emancipation of one Harley Quinn, uh, which oddly enough was the title of my memoirs back in high school. This flick starring Margot Robbie and Ewan McCracken uh, is loaded with explosions, kicking butt, Gogurt and poorly executed New York accents. Like, come on, Margo. I'm pretty sure I could do a better accent in my sleep. Let's check this out. Hey there, Mr. J. I'm Harlequin. I'm not afraid of them big bad bats because I'm crazy. You know, I'm crazy because I wear two different colors of eyeshadow. And that, kids, is how it is done. Hmm. Animal Crossing is finally almost out with just a few months left, meaning I can finally finish my Tom Nook fanfiction that has been on hiatus for nine years. Fun fact, the first part of my fanfic became my became the, the basis for City of Bones. It's called City of Loans. After months of delay, the newly redesigned Sonic the Hedgehog is finally coming out. I haven't been this excited for anything since I stopped using baby diapers and switched to adult ones. After Paramount spent an extra five million dollars to make the original Scary Blue Nightmare go away, it's up to us, the fans, to show up in droves to support it like a pageant mom in the aisles of a Tennessee Little Miss pageant. Little Miss Con. Test. And it's no coincidence that it will be released on February 14th because I don't know about you, but that sounds like the perfect Valentine's Day date for me. So anyone or anything out there is needing a date on Friday night, go ahead and give me a call at my actual number, 574-485-3965. Oh. <laughs> Uh-oh, did I just give out my real number to the entire internet? I can't believe I just did that on my own free will. That might come back to bite me someday. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Dr. Stone is still an anime. Period. <laughs> That's so stupid. The Twitter sphere is a buzz after the first official trailer for Morbius released recently, starring Jared Leto as Matthew Morbius, a scientist with a rare blood disorder. It only took me watching it twice before I realized I was watching a 30 second to Mars music video. Cyberpunk 2077 has once again become, er, been pushed back with a new release date of September. If they're not careful, it may go from starring Keanu Reeves to Keanu Leaves. Oh, God. Oh. While scrolling on Zanga the other day, I found this piece of news. Apparently, a major new castmate was just announced to Loki. The Disney Plus series coming to the next spring of 2021, Owen Wilson, as seen in Wedding Crashers and The Ceiling of My Bedroom, will be joining the show through his specific role is still a mystery. You know what else is a mystery? Like, honestly, where do babies come from? Hmm. Dr. Stone is still an anime. <laughs> Haiku is back for its fourth season. Ooh woo. 
And it's a real spike in the right direction. Because who doesn't love a bent... Mm. Who doesn't love a bunch of men jumping around playing with balls? Other animes that I love that have to do with men playing with balls include Slam Dunk, A Hero No Sora, Ace of the Diamond, Boko no Piku, and Pokemon. Itadeku Masu! I don't know what that means. <laughs> What did I just say? <laughs> is my grandma going to be ashamed of me? Yeah. <laughs> this is PK, which stands for Pretty Kawaii. And this is Bozer, a hardworking class boy, just looking for his waifu for laifu. And until uh, next time, you just keep geeking, geeking out. <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> well, Itsudeki Moss means thank you for the meal. <laughs>